I was at home, got a phone call, and you kind of just know when someone says, I've got something to tell you, you just know what's coming. Obviously, you're buzzing when someone tells you you're going to be a dad. I won't feel nervous, I won't even feel scared until I've got that baby in my arms. Then I will shit myself. Your life is just not about you anymore, and I think that's scary that your responsibility is for this little human being. Telling people, it's, I think it's hard, I told my manager, <laughs> I told Aaron. Telling me mum was one of the scariest things I've ever had to do. I actually got a card and it had congratulations on. My mum was like, yeah, for me. I did the same with my granddad because I couldn't physically tell him. My granddad was like, <laughs> he was like, don't tell us what it is, boy, girl, I don't want to know, 21 are life surprises. My sister was buzzing, my mum was buzzing, my dad was buzzing. I guess the general public were a bit shocked. I think it's just so weird for them thinking of me as a dad. I don't think you know how, what parent you're going to be until you have a baby and you start dealing with them. And I think you've got to just happy medium, you've got to give them what they want sometimes, but then you've got to be strict. Like a lot of kids now on phones when they're like two and three to watch videos and that. I'm not going to be a pushover. <laughs> Every experience is for the first time I will be doing. Like his first pint when he's 18 or his first football game. I just can't wait to do, just crack that whole list. One life lesson, you never know what is around the corner. Life can change like that. If you get an instant go with it and be your own person and don't be a little sheep. <coughs> the biggest hope is that he's healthy. Do you know what I mean? I think that's what, I just want my baby to be healthy and good and fun and he never watches Jory Show. Jory Show.